watching guys got another video on how to fix a corrupt bcd error on windows now you can see the error code is 0xc0000098 and you can see it's a stop error code here we call this a blue screen of death now assuming that your hard drive is in good working order and it is not failing and you don't have any other hardware issues and it is a software related issue i'll show you how to fix it in this video First off, we're going to boot up to the PC. Now, when you boot up your PC, generally what will happen is you can uh, boot up three times and it will crash because it will get a blue screen and it will generally take you to this location here. We're going to go to troubleshoot, then advanced options. Now, startup repair very rarely fixes anything on Windows, so I generally don't bother with this anymore because I've never seen it really repair anything. But you can try it if you want to click on this and try it. If it doesn't work, it will bring you back here and then you can go on to the next step, which is command prompt. Inside the command prompt, you can type out a couple of commands here. So what we're gonna do first is navigate to the C drive, which is our C drive here. I'm gonna type DIR to make sure we can see the Windows directory inside here. From there, we're gonna do boot rec space forward slash fix MBR and then push enter. Type that out and push enter. You should see the operation completed successfully. Then we can move on to the next command, which is boot rec space forward slash fix boot. Once we do this, you should see the operation completed successfully. If you see access denied, then you've got an issue and you may need to uh, do this command to get it to work. So let me do this command here called boot sect space forward slash NT60 space sys make sure you do that command there push enter and you should see some information coming up saying successfully updated then you can try the boot rec space forward slash fix boot again and hopefully this will then go through and it should say the operation completed successfully moving on to the next bit which is the bcd edit space forward slash export space c colon backslash bcd backup just make sure the drive letter is the location of your windows directory if you are typing this out and that should work perfectly fine so we're just going to copy this out here and push enter and you should see operation completed successfully next up we're going to type this next command here 